Beneficiaries of the Livelihood Empowerment Against Poverty LEAP program in the Lower Mania Kobo District of the Eastern Region are asking for an increase in the grant they receive to help improve their livelihoods, especially during the COVID-19 pandemic. Some of the beneficiaries who received double payment as part of government's effort to mitigate the applied say they prefer an increase in the grant they received. A 64-year-old Ataka living with her two unemployed daughters, five grandchildren and husband who has been blind for close to 10 years now. She's a LEAP beneficiary and supports her family with the amount she receives. The old woman says the little of 100 cities she receives as LEAP grant is not sufficient. Hence, she's unable to benefit properly from her corn husk business. That's one of her daughters, Victoria Kutu, although acknowledges government's efforts to make life quite comfortable for people like her mother, also pleaded for the LEAP monthly grants to be increased. <laughs> Other beneficiaries and their families share similar sentiments. <laughs> Some other older vulnerable residents also complain they are not benefiting from the program although they are qualified. This old woman, Aipana, says although her particulars and details were taken some years ago, she has not been rolled onto the system. The Manya Kobo Municipal Director of the Department of Social Welfare and Community Development, Nao Fusu, admitted the grant is indeed not enough but can be beneficial if well invested. The money is not enough because as we even sit here and we take uh, a substantial amount of money at the end of us as our income. We still need more. How much more those the uh, those less privileged? She indicated that there is a monitoring mechanization put in place to ensure benefactors invest their MEGA grants wisely, but cannot deny the fact that there are still some recalcitrant benefactors who will not invest. Randomly, also uh, surprise visits are paid to the beneficiaries. We visit them and see how far they are faring with them small amount that they've been collecting. A report by Sen Ghana in September 2019 revealed that approximately 30,000 LEAP households with over 125,000 beneficiaries in 10 districts across the country were not paid their LEAP cash grants during the 60th bi-monthly payment cycle in June 2019. This development was described as a potential setback to Ghana's poverty reduction efforts and quests for the attainment of the Sustainable Development Goals 1 2 and 10, which aim at ending poverty, zero hunger, and reducing inequalities respectively. Currently, households with one eligible member receive 64 cities per payment cycle. Those with two eligible members receive 76 cities per payment cycle. Three eligible members receive 88 cities per payment cycle. And a household with four or more eligible members, 106 cities per payment cycle. Go straight. This is how we end the news this morning. My name is Godwin Asiba. For more news updates, do join us at 11.30 a.m. on Newsroom. And also, Sewa Mihia will be coming your way shortly with GH Today. Stay safe and be strong. My name is Godwin.